Okay, YouTubers, um, built the body dolly from the plans that everybody seems to have on the internet and watching a few other people, uh, taking some advice from their videos, a couple other channels that I subscribe to. Uh, one guy who's doing a Corvette um, in particular does really good work. Um, and I took his lead on putting spacers down there and the casters in order to get the tray picker um, from underneath it. So thank you for that little tidbit of information. A couple things I got to do. I'm going to build, it's just sitting on inside. It's actually sitting really well. Um, I'm going to build some braces up there to come and uh, probably either one bolt to where the, uh, the supports mount to for the hood or put it blocked up right there because I want to be able to paint the inside of this with the body bunk. Uh, so I gotta do that. I don't have my core support in so it won't land right there at the bottom of the core support like they usually do. Um, and uh, the other thing is, is I'm gonna build, since mine's convertible, it's spread in the doors a little bit just sitting on the uh, birdcage. And oh, I built it to the plans, but I used uh, two by fours as well as that other gentleman did that uh, I watched him on the YouTube. Um, but I had to cut out that brace right there, uh, right, because it hit the body right there. There's not enough room to get that up in there for it to land snugly up in there. And then I just put these braces in and added these two braces and then trimmed them back. So it all sits pretty well up underneath there for the body bunk. So that's what I had to deviate from the plans. Um, as far as, let me stand back. As far as, uh, to get the body bunk to, to fit on there really well, the body cart. Um, but it fits really well up underneath the bird cage. It's really sturdy and, stir and, and, and everything. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build some bra braces that come off and go up that way and probably land somewhere right up in there, maybe right there, that, that flat spot right there is really good. So I'll get the body realigned um, with my friction jacks and some other things to get it where it needed to be put and then uh, build the braces around that so the body sits level. Um, also want to do that too because I don't want to build a rear box on the back of it because when I go to load it up on a flatbed to take it anywhere, um, I, will have, I would have those extra set of casters to contend with and if you articulate the body you put all the pressure on that caster set that are, is not there that I would put right there and on the very front caster set to get it to load it up on any flatbed. So um, I'd rather have it setting on that caster set and the front caster set to minimize flex on the body cart. So anyway, that's what I'm doing. Uh, and then I got to sort down the frame. So that's, that's next once I get this all cleaned up. But yeah, worked out well. The body dolly really worked out well. Anyway, thank you. Peace out.